the search for a firm starting offensive line in South Florida is underway. And based on the early action at training camp, it doesn't appear to be nearing a conclusion, either. The Dolphins have played musical chairs up front early on, giving multiple players the chance to compete for the starting left guard and right tackle positions. It would appear as though Austin Jackson and Robert Hunt are the only two linemen with a definitive, unquestioned hold on a spot in the top five. Former Wisconsin Badger Michael Deiter appears, at least early on, to have a modest hold at center, too. But the left guard role was turned on its head over the last few days with the decision to push 2021 second-round draft choice Liam Eichenberg over from his initial spot at right tackle and into the left guard role. That decision pushed second-year guard Solomon Kindley down the ranks, where he has stayed in the practices that have followed. And if this is the recipe the Dolphins choose to follow in order to get Eichenberg on the field, the team's depth at tackle will be tested in the weeks and months to follow. Yes, Jesse Davis and Jermaine Aluemunor have experience playing tackle, and the team added Larnell Coleman in the seventh round of the 2021 NFL Draft. Plus Robert Hunt has played tackle going back to Louisiana and his 2020 rookie season. But Alumunur isn't overly experienced in meaningful reps. And Coleman is even less so, even if he took some first-team reps on the line during Wednesday's practice. And the team seems somewhat committed to pushing Hunt to play right guard, where all reports indicate that the team feels his ceiling is higher. Which leaves Jesse Davis and not much else to man the right tackle spot. So while Miami looks to light the proper fire under Solomon Kindley, they're risking pushing Eichenberg further away from the team's apparent goal of him playing right tackle for the Dolphins. Eichenberg has played on both sides of the line during his career at Notre Dame but most recently played left tackle and is accustomed to a left side of the line stance. This is one of the key storylines for the Dolphins, especially considering the status of Tua Tungavailoa as a left-handed quarterback puts the team's right tackle on their signal caller's blindside. And with just about a week's worth of practices in the books, the Dolphins appear no closer to a firm resolution at the right tackle and left guard jobs. That's an understandable place to be, but the team must proceed with caution, given the relative inexperience of most of the contenders. Once the team picks a lane with personnel, they're likely going to need to stick to it with conviction. Or perhaps they already have and we just don't know it yet.